So it's very exciting for me to see this because this is um, this is a way of exhibiting work that that I'm particularly interested in now as an artist generally, and especially interested in this this particularized kind of kind of picture, this particularized kind of work. Um, one thing that's that's important, I think, to point out for people who don't know or do know a lot about photography is that is that these pictures are all made with a with a view camera. They're all made with an eight by ten inch camera. So that the negative is eight inches by ten inches and therefore requires an extraordinarily long exposure. So even pictures like this, which are taken on a bright sunny day, might require a two second exposure. A picture like this or this might require a 20 minute exposure. Pictures like this and this and this have supplemental light uh, added in my case by uh, a relatively bright flash fired off sometimes as many as a hundred times. So that uh, although the pictures appear to be about what's directly in front of the camera, the fact is that in many cases they're lit as carefully as say a, theater, a, a theatrical presentation or a film still. Um, none of these pictures are taken casually. That is to say, they all require a tripod, they all require pre-focusing, they require a lot of time to set up. Uh, as anybody who's familiar with North Dakota knows, every single one of the pictures outside is taken in the wind. So, for example, uh, this picture here, I remember distinctly, uh, my assistant Mark and I stood outside this, if you can see, this, this run of, of, of barbed wire, which is actually only about this far from the camera, stood in front of this barbed wire by the side of the road for at least an hour, waiting for the wind to die down. Stupid Easterners, back in Boston, Occasionally, the wind stops. Of course, out in the middle of the prairie, it might not stop for three days. But we sat there waiting like a pair of fools. And I remember finally we looked at each other and said, let's just do it and see what happens. And so actually, this is about a two second exposure in the wind. And even though it's not razor, razor, razor sharp, it's perfectly, it's perfectly usable. <laughs> so, so we were able to some degree triumph over circumstances.